and I just wanted to show you guys what it's like to be at an actual crop. This is the crop for um, Angela Coleman raises money for kittens. It's a kitten rescue. So I thought we would go around and see what everybody brought. So just hold on and let's go see what, what everybody has. Hi, Darlene. Hi. Bring the so everybody wants to know what to bring to the crop. So tell me, what are your talking about bringing to the crop? My normal kit with scissors, my glue, uh, scissors, tape runner, scotch tape, um, and then my inks, markers. You always have to have baby wipes because I get ink all over my fingers. So. Smart one. <laughs> yeah. So and then we do we do cards here, so the card kits are already made up by each one of us. So that's what I bring generally. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Oops. Hey there, what do you have in your bag today? I don't remember your name, do you, Tracy? It's our seat. Okay. Well, like Darlene said, we're doing cards today. So this is my card kit, and this is what I'm going to be teaching today to everybody. I also can that? sure can. Look at that. I also am sending these to Alberta for my grandchildren for Christmas. This goes to some of my friends. This is just to look at Wink Estella. There's all kinds of stuff. We have our little cakes. And there's my little thing for sponges and crayon pencils. Now I've lent uh, Maxine down there my markers because she just came in late and doesn't have all her stuff and all my clues are down there. And uh, a little tote bag to bring all the extras in case you need to. And then I use my this is a punch line, okay? I stamp him up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Anyone that's interested in purchasing Stampin' Up products, talk to Darlene, talk my to daughter. Darlene, your daughter. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. Thanks so much. And I forgot to show you, there's my card that I brought for everybody to make today. That's so pretty. And that's the Darlene nice. isn't me, it's the other Darlene. <laughs> <laughs> now I know the Stampin' Up. Do you want to pause it? Other Darlene, <laughs> which is Elsie's daughter, that's all stampin' up. And what do you have in your bag today? We have a okay. Well, I got my uh, distressed inks. Very nice. Oh, you have to show this. This is the smartest thing ever. Oh, and I have a little trick. That's <laughs> right. You did tell me you wanted to put that in the video. It's, I didn't invent it, I found it. But what you do is you take your little minis and you go to the dollar store and you buy Velcro. And then the and then you take these little guys and stick them in the bottom. When you're ready to use that color, you put it on there, and now you can use and it stays with the color. It doesn't cross contaminate. It's such a great idea. Thank you. And what else do you have in your bag today? Um, yes, I have a Stampin' Up paper cutter that is pretty cool. It's a it's a cutter and an embosser, and in the bottom, this opens up, and you can store your and you can even store your cards. Yes, the scoring for the cards. Yeah, I, uh, that's pretty yeah, cool. cool. I'll be sure to put your information in the yes. description. This is really cool. Yes, thank you. This isn't something I sell. My mom bought it for us. It's called a crystal panada. And what you do is when you have jewels or diamonds, it's got a little wax end. You just touch the jewel and put it right into the glass, and it sticks and it stays and it's just wax. This is your, you know, every animal has its 
Okay, let's put it on my Christmas list. <laughs> Where did you guys get it? Uh, we got it in Syracuse, but there's a Canadian supply market. I think it's thirty-five dollars Canadian, and then there's American suppliers. It's about twenty-six American. But I've got the Canadian website, the date, but like the company that sells it. Um, unless you can get it on your own, maybe we'll send you the link. Thank you. So happy shopping. Yeah, that was in your bag? Oh, yeah. I'm going to be in residuals. <laughs> okay. So that's the purpose of this, is to pick up the jewels, because there's 34 of them. Oh, they're beautiful, though. So I put the little glue down, and then I'm going to sell the piece of Did you get the little silver from Ecstasy Crafts? The silver? Yeah. Yeah? Which? which? Very the little, The little silver trims? The, oh. These, oh, the gems? No, that's... No, not the gems, the stickers that you use. Oh, no, powder. that's a stamped image. Oh, is it? Yeah. And heat embossed? Yes, in silver and silver, heat embossed. And then you cut out the tree, and then you cut, have all these extras, and you just build it up. And then you put your jewels on, and some stickles. Oh, yes, very nice. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> that's been awesome. fun. We'll I'll see. be expecting one of those in the mail come this okay. summer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went to do it. I haven't done it for years, and I went to do it like this. Wait, now, where do I get those? <laughs> so there you go. Happy shopping, enjoy. Oh so just a second. Are you taping? Yeah. Okay. I have a scary sponge. In case I want to clean my oven. <laughs> <laughs> In case I feel like doing dishes. <laughs> I have a picture of that. No. Is there anything crashing related in that bag? Uh, yes, I have blue strips. Okay. I have blue dots. All kinds of blue dots. Oh, thank you. Very talented woman made this. <laughs> <laughs> Do the baby wipes. You never know when you need to be fresh. <laughs> Actually, it's for strap. And oh, you really want to know everything. Lip <laughs> That's important at a crop. <laughs> My gun, of course. Um, all kinds of like bling, pens, exacto knife, scissors. Okay, this is my friend Denise, and she's actually been on the blog before. She's the one that made the beautiful Julie Nutting calendar. But we're going to ask her what's in her bag today. Christmas cards. <laughs> Can you zoom in and we'll just show some of these cards. They're so beautiful. And that's the Stampin' Up! teddy bear, isn't it? Yes, it is. Very cute. There's no Stampin' Up! Oh, nice. That's cool. And you brought this, right? I did. That's what my verse is like. And this is the Fisker's press. Is it? What's this called? I used to know. It's my sponge thingy. Okay. <laughs> well, we'll look up the we'll look up the name of this Fisker's product and we'll put it in the details. So, but this is very handy because you can stamp the same image perfectly each time. Yeah. And it also works really good to line up the words with the lines, so mm -hmm. that you know that it's straight. You can use the edges to just line it up on your so you you didn't worry about that, right? Not this particular. <laughs> Actually, I was in the process of taking this one off. <laughs> I was gonna change it. Thanks, Denise. So, what am I supposed to do? So far, we've had chaps. <laughs> okay. okay, I have to show this. Because okay. This is just amazing. Okay. How cute that is. <laughs> Everyone should buy one of these. Except it's recollections, but that's yes, okay. Yes, but you don't take that. Actually, it's perfect. So, I'm working on my little you're a happy planner. Okay, so it's perfect for these little pictures and cutting them down. So that's where it stays with that. Excellent. And I'm working on project like So if I get myself, I'll get a nice tool. Very good. Yeah. So and do you buy kits for your happy planner or, or your work with stickers? That um, actually, I have some of their, their sticker packages, but I also use up a lot of my old um, all my old goodies too. Okay. To go on, so. Excellent.
Well, see, and this is a good example of what you bring to the prom. Lots of goodies. And stuff you use and stuff you don't use. That's the result. Yeah. Okay, well, thank you. Yeah, I'm working on a recipe. Oh, beautiful. A lot of that. Especially on watercolor paper, I can uh, stamp more than once in the same spot. Mm -hmm. So it's excellent for when you're doing the watercolor stuff. So I brought my watercolor pens with me. Dogs in the video. That's because I do a little bit of digital. Too, so. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Thanks for sharing. You're welcome. Wow. Okay, I can describe it. Oh, you did? Yes. Okay. But you're also working on kits. Yes. Which I think a lot of people, when they go to a prom, they think, you know, art is about people. Yeah. You're showing, like, that you brought your happy planner. Yeah. I brought a kit. Yeah. So, for my happy planner, I brought my planner. And I'm just fixing up and finishing off paint. It's like I have a square left there. I brought my stickers to fill in. All kinds of scrap paper to decorate it. And of course, the center of the Yeah. <laughs> and all of this, these are all kits that I was going to do Christmas cards this afternoon. And I don't think I'm going to get there. <laughs> and I did some, I did a kit this morning. One of the great things about going to a prom is that you don't have to bring um, lots of people come in groups and they share and they take turns bringing their supplies. This group is one of the ones that I've admired for a long time because they bring everything that's so organized. They have like a little production going on more. So over here, they're making little penguins. And what else is going on here? The snowman. 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 It's for children. Cards. So it's snowman. 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 Ah, <laughs> oh, so cute. Oh, it's so cute. That's wonderful. And these are for children's cards? Laser cards? Uh, but they share the punches. Um, some people bring the ink. Um, so, 
she brought her stamp cleaners and her blocks and a variety of stamps. Did you pre-cut before you gave? 
by pre-embossed, yes, pre-cut and pre-embossed. So you're just doing an assembly? We're doing assembly. Perfect. Alright, and what's in your scrapbook bag today? Um, I, I didn't pick enough, actually. <laughs> I just brought my card to send this with me, and then of course my still bag. Lots of adhesive stuff. Yeah, I, I, I need to take notes, so I always have a lot.